They're up. I don't think I'm gonna close them though. Okay, I close them. Nope. There's no slot to close it! Alright guys, first of all, I wanted Friday's video to be a fun video, so I decided to put this one in here. However, I gotta thank you all for all the comments you left on the last video. I asked you guys for your input on what kind of videos you guys want to see more of. And the one I hear most people asking for is fasting. So Monday's video will be like ponies and fairy tales talk about fasting. I honestly, like I didn't want to do it because I felt like I already spoke about it enough. Like I've been doing it for so long. I've included it in videos. I thought, what else is there to say about it? But so many people had asked about it. So I'm like, okay, let me see what's going on. Why are people so confused about this? Well, Online world has a whole bunch of information, things that I don't think apply to women, things that you should be cautious about, kind of some warnings that they don't talk about. Um, and yeah, it's going to be an important video, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave it for Monday so that I can get my thoughts organized and, and give you guys the best information I can possibly give you. But first, we're going to do a jean haul. Um, I, oh my god, the process, the amount of returns I had to make, the, the weirdest things I had to see while doing this, you guys should thank me because I have found the best jeans. I have some bad jeans in here. Some I can't, well, I don't care to return because it's a long process, but I figured I'd use them for information purposes anyways. So we're going to kind of jump into it. Um, like, there are $50 jeans here and then $18 jeans here. This is over a month. Oh my, no, it's longer than a month. I think it's like two months because some things I was waiting for them to arrive. They took forever when they arrived. I'm like, this is shit going back. <laughs> um, and it took me a long time to find good jeans, why I like them, variety of jeans. So I think we should get started. <laughs> short jeans. Short jeans? Short jeans, not long jeans. Yeah, shorts. Shorts this time. And then I did find like a couple comfy ones, shorts that I'm going to show you guys. Um, so yeah, let's get started. All right, so where to begin? I think with the white pair. <laughs> Okay, so white pair I chose first because I always have to have one pair of white shorts at least. I love how white shorts look. They can go very wrong. They could be too see-through. That's why I wore like these neon green colorful underwear. Uh, just so you guys can see if they're actually see-through or not. These are not. They fit really nice on the booty. Um, I like it for that reason. I did leave the tags on for you guys just so you guys know that I didn't just pull these out of my closet from like two years ago and you're not going to be able to find them. They are all brand new keeping um i am gonna take the tags off because i do like these a lot uh anything else i look oh by the way i think i bought larges and everything there's one pair of pants which when i get there i'll tell you guys um that it does it came like in like the weird sizes like well, you go medium. for 20 huh that was medium this is medium this is a medium i bought medium and they fit woohoo i think i don't know is that a good thing or a bad thing i bought medium <laughs> I really thought they were all largest. All right, I'm gonna have to double check all the tags. Uh, so white ones are medium. Um, damn, they put little damn tags on these. Finally. <laughs> so there you have them. I like. <laughs> uh, moving on, these, I call them a mama jeans. Uh, they're super comfy, but you're gonna see why they're kind of mama jeans, but I like them for that reason. Very, very stretchy. These are medium too, but you know what? I bought them in large. These are, I had to exchange them. They're $50 pants, so obviously. When I put them on, I was like, these have potential. I'd like to see what the right size looks like on me. Um, so shut up and just try them on. Okay, so these are my mama shorts. Uh, the reason I call them mama shorts are they go pretty high up, like your high-waisted pants, um, but the length, like the length is good, nothing sticks out, you can bend over, no butt cheeks are out. Um, they're kind of like a stretchy, chill, I don't know, I don't know what's, like, they give you that mama feel like, you ain't being too sexy, you know, you know, but they, they're still cute, whatever. <laughs> is that bad, because I want a pair of mama jeans? It's not bad, right? Yeah. No. Okay, yeah, so for that reason, I like them. These are mediums. They do run very large. Like, even the mediums are loose on me. Something I experience a lot is, like, having this thing. Um, I, I don't mind too much. It's not, it's not that bad. Plus, it gives me some space if I decide to eat a lot or something, you know? If anything, I'll put, like, a skinny belt on to keep them on good. But overall, I really like these. I don't know what it is about them, but they're so comfortable. You just want to wear them. Moving on. Um... 
Let's go to these. These are super flattering. They're probably his favorite. No, they are his favorite. Um, and also the cheapest. So we went from the most expensive to the cheapest, $18, I believe. So actually, these are the smaller size. I, I It's a size five. Um, and to them, they said it can reach up to like 44 inch on the hip. And I'm a 41.5. So I'm like, I got this. This is my size. I mean, they just look small when you look at them. Um, I'm going to show you kind of what happens when you don't buy your size and they look kind of tight. I do have the right size, which will be after, but I'm going to show you the really small pair now so you guys can see what it looks like. All right, so they look good to the naked eye. However, once you start actually looking at the pants and seeing if they flatter you or not, uh, this is important because people will miss this detail. You can probably look, I'm sure many of us have walked past the girl and been like, girl, that ain't your size. <laughs> and to you, it looked good, or maybe even to some people it looks good, but because I'm kind of crazy and I like my things to be well fitted, here's the problem with these. All of a sudden, I got more fat. Where did this fat come from? I could swear it wasn't there before. So not wearing your size makes it appear that you're larger than you are. You create problem areas that aren't really there. I mean, granted, I do store fat here, but it's really not that bad. If we, if we really think about it, it's not that bad, but these pants are making it look like it's terrible. Now, moving to the back. There's just all types of wrong here. So we still got this, but then it squeezes my thighs. And you know when you have cellulite, but you can only see it when you kind of squeeze or you're sitting wrong? These make it look like that because it's squeezing you there. So like I, you see cellulite down here, right? Can you see it on camera? Probably not, but I see it. And that's just because it's, it's just cutting circulation. <laughs> and that's kind of a problem for me. Also, I don't like when I get little butt cheek out because when you do it kind of just looks like you got a lot of fat there, you know? That's what it looks like to me. Um, but like first glance, you might think, oh, they, they fit cute, they fit fine, but not really. Let me show you one size up how much better they're gonna look on me. <laughs> so let's try these on. All right, so now I look skinny. See, no fat is bulging here. I can even eat a little bit without extra bulging, you know? But right when you see it, it just looks more flattering. The butt, I think, looks good. <laughs> I think it looks very flattering on the butt. Nothing is being squished here, which is super important for me. Um, by the way, these are super stretchy. I don't think I mentioned that. Like, looking at these, I'm like, these are not going on. I mean, just look at them. Like, they look like they're for teenagers, but they are like ridiculously stretchy. Um, just, I, I wanted to add that in there. But do you see the amazing effect? All of a sudden, I do look very fit and lean, as opposed to, girl, you got a muffin going on there. <laughs> You know, so choose the right size makes such a big difference. Uh, moving on, we're gonna go to these. These are like the butt lift jeans, wax. I figured I may as well try one. So we're gonna do those next. <laughs> also cheaper. These are part of the cheaper ones. All right, so these are pretty, very cute actually, very stretchy. I do like the fit of them. Here's the booty. Now, the neat thing about shopping on Amazon, um, if you purchase a Prime thing, it says Prime, and then you usually get it like within two days, those you can return at Kohl's, which is like the easiest return ever. You literally go here, Kohl's, I mean, sure, you gotta say you're gonna return it. They give you a little barcode scanner, they scan it, which is really awesome. Now, if you buy something that's gonna take like two months to get there, that is not gonna go through Kohl's, obviously. I tried to avoid that, but I did not because I was so sold on these pants, and I will show you exactly why. Be careful of people who Photoshop, not just in the fitness industry, but on Amazon trying to sell you pants that look terrible and look nothing like the picture. So beware of that. I should have known because like nobody's body is shaped that way, but we'll get there when we get there. Um, <clears throat> I like them. They're, they're one of those foolproof jeans that you don't like, they are what they are. <laughs> you, what you see is what you get. So for that reason, I do like these. I keep turning this way, I have a mirror. I forgot to mention that, I probably look crazy. Um, these, I was, <clears throat> I was a little weird about. These are size five I got. And more for the size, but he really liked them, so I figured I'd keep them, but uh, yeah, let's try them on. Okay, now the thing I like about these was the dark color, the roughed up, also folded and roughed up, because if you see, I get folded ones, like you can find these, but they don't have like the roughed up part. And I kind of wanted a pair of shorts that looked a little bit rough. The thing I didn't like was this, because at first glance, it almost looked like your pants were torn, or I don't know, you you did it yourself or something, I don't know. But he doesn't feel that way. He thinks they look good, the pockets look good, nothing to really complain about here besides that. That was my only thing, but comfort wise, stretchy, all these are stretchy, because you know you need stretch in there if you're gonna put your butt in there and you want it to be flattering. Um, so overall, pretty cute jeans. These, I said were size five, right? Yeah, size five. Moving forward, I am gonna show you 
the ones that were an illusion photoshopped and I will even show you the model that they used um, so that you guys can see these are large so when I get a large it's like guaranteed to fit if anything it might be too big which is okay um, but yeah let's show you this <gasps> they're up I don't think I'm gonna close them though okay I close them nope There's no slot to close it. It's closed. Like there's a hole to actually. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> this is the style of these jeans. Literally the style of these jeans. I mean, maybe you could. No. No. <laughs> no. No, all right. So I'm gonna show you guys the photo on the side of what these jeans were supposed to be. Super stretchy, there's no stretch happening here. <laughs> no stretch happening. Do these look high-waisted to you like the photo? Hell no, they're probably lower than all of these jeans and these were mid-rise jeans. I wanted a pair of high-waisted jeans. I'm scared to show you the back. What the hell is that? Bro, do you even lift? Cause my ass does not look like a lift at all in these. Cake, right? Mm -hmm. Imagine if I did close them, what would it look like? Oh my god. Pick the right size, guys. Pick the right size and always go for stretch. These were just a loss. I accept it. I need to take them off like immediately because I think they're cutting blood circulation here. <laughs> but yeah, these are a no no. I just wanted to add them in there to show you guys. You can't always trust things online. However, I will mention Amazon reviews, they are the best. You can literally get popcorn and sit there and read all the reviews and have a great time. <sighs> Makes you wonder. That's all I gotta say. Makes you wonder what people's expectations are. Sometimes someone will put something on and be like, it is so cute. Oh my God. And it's like, what part of it is cute? Can you explain this to me? <laughs> Thank God for those Amazon reviews because they have saved me bunches of time. I'm gonna take these off now. We're gonna go to like comfy pants now, comfy shorts, because I found two really, really great ones and I wanna share them. First, these nice gray ones. Let's go ahead and try them on. They're cotton, stretchy, just comfy. Okay, now I was looking for something comfy I can just lounge around in or work out in because my gym gets really hot since it's in the garage and I get really sweaty and I don't want tight, heavy clothes on me. Uh, very breezy, very light, cotton, just, I don't know, they're so cute, you know? Um, yesterday we had crazy weather because it got like super hot, but then the next day it's like cold and you need sweaters. So um, I kind of wanted to get some shorts for that reason. And finding cotton shorts that flatter is very difficult for some odd, odd reason. But these are very cute, I must say. I also got them in white. Uh, Review said super not see-through. Not see-through at all, guys. Like everyone said not see-through at all. Bullshit, you lied. <laughs> they are so see-through. I don't know what would make people say they're not see-through, but try them on just to show you guys. <laughs> all right, you may not see it through the camera, but trust me, you see my entire thing, everything. And I, when I first tried them on, I was wearing nude and you still saw it. It was insane. These are very see-through. It was dark too. Yeah, it was dark and I'm like, not see-through, huh? <laughs> I mean, I don't really care. I'll probably use them to sleep in, go commando, you know, like, you know, girl stuff. You sleep with no underwear, but nice comfy pair of shorts, but yeah, completely see-through. These will be just for the bedroom. Yeah. Oh, next one. This is the last one. Very, very flattering. All right, very cute. As you guys know, if you guys saw the video with him picking out clothes for me, he got me two pairs of shorts that were similar to this. Uh, the reason I like these is they go up on the side. So like when you see the shorts, they're kind of like this, kind of silly looking. I was like, this is not gonna work for me. But it actually works nicely because it shows like a little peak here, which for some reason, I don't know, I kind of like it. Um, <clears throat> the booty is very flattering. These are a little shorter than the ones that he got me, but I do really like them. I did order another pair, but for some reason, like these came really fast. The other pair is gonna take like a month to get here, which is weird since it was the same seller. But overall, I really like it. If you guys are wondering, the top can also be found on Amazon. I wore it in my obsessions video too, actually. I really like this top. Can you guys tell? Uh, super inexpensive. I want to say seven to eight dollars. Maybe. Maybe nine. Um, but yeah, really, really cute. And I think that concludes the shorts haul. As always, everything is going to be linked in the description box. This is why I do it for you guys. If you guys like these Amazon reviewer kind of things, because I like to buy an Amazon a lot. Like, I, when was the last time we went to the mall? I don't even remember. 
right? I don't have patience anymore, not after having a baby. Like, I think I'm gonna have patience, I get there and I'm like, let's go home, like, within 15 minutes. Because it's really hard, like, when you're worried about her, she doesn't wanna stay in the stroller anymore, but she wants to run around, but you're like, no, I don't want her running around, I don't want anyone stealing her from me or something. So you give, like, the anxiety and the stress after we leave the mall is like totally not worth it. So I like Amazon for that reason. I like that they post reviews, real reviews, of real people, um, pictures, all that stuff. So that's why I'm kind of addicted to Amazon. And I like to show you guys things from there instead of like, I've had so many companies approach me, so many begging because uh, one of my hauls got like 1 million views, went like super viral. So now every company wants to get in on it. And I'm like, no, because I settle. You settle, you know, you get things that you're kind of like, I would actually never buy this, but because it's part of this and I got to do it because I agreed, you know, so I don't do it for that reason with any company actually. And just this month, I think I was approached by like four companies. Um, I would rather just do my own research, find what I like and then share it with you guys. So <clears throat> if you like more of these videos, be sure to give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, definitely stay tuned, hit that little bell. For notifications because lots of ponies and fairy tales conversations coming up soon enjoy your weekend guys and until monday bye